Hello, my name is Jared Sheldon and I'm with the Benley Technical Support Team. Have you ever wondered how to get MicroStation to display coordinates in latitude and longitude? In this video, we're going to go over how to change the coordinates from X and Y to latitude and longitude, place points with a key in command, and import a set of points. First, I'm going to make sure the units I'm using are the ones I want. So I'm going to come up to File, Settings, File, Design File Settings, angle readout and I'm going to change the format from degrees and decimal degrees to degrees, minutes, and seconds and then hit OK. Next let's go to the utilities ribbon and click on the coordinate system icon. Next we're going to click on the from library icon. Then we'll click on library, projected, North America, United States, Pennsylvania, and for this example, I'll choose the third one down by double-clicking on it. Since the units of my model and the units of the coordinate system are different, this message appears. I'm just going to go ahead and hit OK, saying that the units my model is drawn in is right. Now in order to make the coordinate system we just picked our active coordinate system, I'm going to come up to the search ribbon and search for our auxiliary coordinates. And now I'll double-click on the coordinate system we just chose to make it our active coordinate system, and I'll exit out of this. Now we're going to go to the home ribbon, into the key and icon and type in set TP mode ACS locate and then hit enter. Now if we come down to the bottom we can right click and turn on running coordinates. Now the coordinates of our cursor are displayed in degrees, minutes, and seconds across the bottom. We can also enter points using the key and command. In order to make the points easier to see, first I'm going to come up here and change the line thickness, and then change the color of the points. For this example, I'll use this point. To enter a point, type in point, ACS absolute, the number of degrees followed by D, the number of minutes followed by M, and then the number of seconds. Notice that there is no S after seconds. This is because MicroStation reads S as south instead of seconds. Then put a comma and type in the degrees, minutes, and seconds of your Y coordinate for the point. And now hit enter. So if I come over and click fit view and then move the key in box out of the way, you'll see a point was placed up here on the top of the screen. You can also import points from another location on your computer. For example, here's an ASCII text file I prepared for this video. In order for the points to come into MicroStation correctly, first type in place point, then hit enter, and then for every line where you have a point, put point, ACS, absolute, and then your latitude and longitude. End each line with a semicolon, and only have one point per line. Then, once you have all the points you want, at the very end, hit enter, and then type in reset on its own separate line. Now to get the points into MicroStation. First go up and hit points. Then in the key in box, type in the path of the file which contains the points you want to import. Now if we hit enter and then fit view, we can see that more points were placed along the bottom of the screen. Thank you all for watching and have a good day.